days after that devastating fire that took the lives of three people, including two children. We see this growing memorial right on the front step of that home. It's why the Baltimore City Fire Department went door to door in this neighborhood. A working smoke detector in every Baltimore home. I think that's pretty good that everyone is able to have a smoke detector. It's the goal of the Baltimore City Fire Department. Saturday morning, the city canvassed the Highland Town neighborhood where a deadly fire happened earlier this week. Be knocking on the doors, offering to install free smoke alarms, uh, basic home fire safety inspections, as well as providing a literature. Uh, to help them know how to keep themselves safe from the dangers of residential structure fires. It's how city leaders spent their morning, all while a memorial grows outside of a home where a charred smell still lingers. I heard about um, what happened and I have felt a little saddened, you know, and I have been thinking about it all week. Leorsha Stokes, one of several people paying her respects to her East Lombard Street neighbors. Three lives were lost, including two children. Fire officials say there were no working smoke detectors inside of the home. But we don't have to have this happen in our city. Uh, we want every single family, every single household to have a, a fire safety plan. Trying to make sure everyone is protected to avoid having to make another memorial. I decided to go get some flowers and my balloons to come around here. I said my little prayer and everything. And, you know, I just wanted to come around here and bring it. And we're back here once again at this growing memorial right in front of this family's home here in Highland Town. Baltimore City Fire Department does encourage you if you do not have a working smoke detector to call 311. They say firefighters will be at your door here in the city in less than two hours. From Highland Town, I'm Tori Yorgi, WBAL TV 11 News.